She Wait was... a minute, I got what happened? too many buttons open here. Oh, it's sexy. Yeah. <laughs> no. That wasn't That's... good? That's better. Oh, uh, really? Yeah. This, yeah. this, and look what this turned out to be. I think when you were first on the show, um, it, it, was it on the charts even? I think you had just written it. No, Ellen, let, let me explain something to you. <laughs> you were the first person who my publicist called who put me on the show with the book. You were the very first one that even said, Steve Harvey's got a book, I'm putting him on. Mm -hmm. And we had started selling, but I tell you, I, I gotta give, I gotta really say thank you because you put me on first. It was a, it was an amazing shot. And in it the went arm. to number one, right? Yes. Went to number one. <laughs> For how long? Like 40 weeks or something? Uh, it's been on the best selling list like 40 some weeks. It was number one at like 30 weeks in a row. Well, number one for 30 weeks in a row. Been on the best selling list for 40. It's still on there. It's number it's eight, still right? Still on there. Yeah, I, I don't watch it now. Once I fail from grace of number one, uh -huh. I stop watching. <laughs> Don't stop. That's still making you some money, being on the bestseller list in the New York Times. And now you're an expert, a relationship expert on GMA because of yeah, this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good Morning America. I come on. I'm a correspondent now. Uh-huh. How that happened, I, I don't know. Because uh, this happened because of this. You, you actually have really good ideas, advice for how you treat a lady. Well, you know, I've, I've, you know, you know, you get a lot of flack from it, though, sometimes, you know, because, you know, I mean, this is my third marriage, so people go, well, how can he tell me anything about women? He been married three times. Well, hell, at least I can get somebody, you know. That's right. That's the way you look at it. Yeah, you know, just... And how does your... Well, your wife must be thrilled. Yeah. Marjorie? Yeah, yeah, she is, my beautiful. I love her. Yeah. She's great. Do doesn't help my marriage at all. This book has been the worst thing I've ever done. Because, you know, now, like, when we argue now, she refers to the book. Like, in what way? So what are you going to say now, mister? You wrote the book. <laughs> what does the book say? And I never know what the book uh -huh. says, because I'm under pressure. Because uh -huh. women apply immense amounts of pressure when you argue. Because you, you all have a Rolodex of stuff we've done in the past. <laughs> and no matter what the argument starts out about, it never ends up there. Because if it looks like I'm going to win the argument, she just changes the subject. <laughs> Women are brilliant like that. And you do it all the time. And we just... We... <laughs> well, why are you talking? <laughs> That'll be the next book. Uh-huh. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> called Why You Clapping. Um, <laughs> and here, <laughs> here you are with your beautiful wife. She is beautiful, Marjorie, on the cover of yeah. Essence magazine. Look at that. That's, oh, that, you're, that's beautiful. <laughs> here I am with Oprah. Yes. Yeah. Just a little bit of difference in money and fame. Uh -huh. just, uh, uh, just a little bit. Look, yeah. you all are doing. Yeah. This is, uh, how about that, being on the cover of O? Oh, how did you do that? Yeah. Uh -huh. How did you get that done? I don't know. All started as a joke, and it end up ha ended up happening. Um, if you, they're only on uh, stands for six more days if you'd like to buy a few copies. I'm, because you supported the book, I'm going to buy it. As a matter okay. of fact, I'm going to announce it on my radio show. You okay. are the only the second person to ever get on this magazine. I know, the first lady and myself. Isn't that crazy? It's crazy. <laughs> now my goal is to be on Essence. <laughs> my goal is to be on Essence with you. Yeah. <laughs> they, they mostly put black women on there, but... Uh -huh. yeah. I think they'll make an exception, because uh, <laughs> you did make this one. Uh -huh, so. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let's talk about uh, who, uh, who you'd give uh, advice to right now, because I know if you're the expert, I don't know if anyone's asked you this, but who needs love advice right now? I think I know who you're going to say. Tiger, Tiger, mm -hmm. Tiger. <laughs> tiger needs it. Best thing I can tell Tiger right now is <laughs> Tiger need to quit eating out. Because, obviously, hostesses and waitresses are big on the list right now. Uh -huh. Tiger need to start going to drive throughs <laughs> <laughs> And the only other 
first thing, if I was Tiger, I'd just start ordering Domino's, because I have never, ever met an attractive Domino delivery man. <laughs> ever. <laughs> you know, that's... <laughs> I can't believe what's happening to this guy. I, I know. really can't. Have you met him before? No, never yeah. have. That was one of my goals, too. That was one of the people I always wanted to meet. Yeah. And now I can't let him anywhere near me. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm happily married, and what I don't need to be doing is sitting next to Tiger right uh, now. Anyway. You're hosting for the 10th year in a row. Uh, what is it? For... BT Celebration of Gospel. Celebration of Gospel, which I've yeah. seen you do before. You're so hilarious. Yeah. So hilarious. And you've talked about that's a tricky one for you to do because you have to be real careful about what you say. Well, you know, you got to be really clean. It's, it's, it was tough for me because I built my career on HBO, you know. Mm -hmm. I've gotten older. I've changed, you know. And I'm, I'm, I'm trying to be like a really good Christian. Um, but um, cussing is um, <laughs> so important to me. <laughs> It's just some appropriate moments for it, and I just yeah. can't... I haven't found the way to substitute them all yet. Uh -huh. You know, it's just some stuff that's cuss-appropriate, you know? Uh -huh. I haven't found out how to filter it uh -huh. yet. It's just some things, you know, like if you're in the grocery store and your little baby runs up on the back of your heel with the grocery cart, I, I don't know what else to say to him. <laughs> you know? Is that a point? Yes, I, I have... I have... You know, I can't go, oh, golly, oh, for crying out loud. That's, no. Yeah. You, and then you got to just and fire him and, uh -huh. and put him in a row and use combinations that make him never do it again. That's, uh -huh. that's the only thing. <laughs> but I've seen you do it. You're hilarious. 